feel like it's a metaphor for our current situation in this country. I, I could see some parallels yeah, there. Yeah, right? Yeah. One's a debonair, a little... dashing type spy, and the other one's just brute force getting things yeah, done. Yeah, And you'd certainly think the that thing... those two, it would be like like oil and water, or like fire and ice. Yeah, something or like, like that. Or like Hobbes and Shaw. Hobbes and Shaw. Yeah. But they, they, but they came together to do it. They came together to do it because of the greater good. Good for And yeah. now, spoiler, do they save the world? No, that was hilarious. <laughs> that was the best part is they messed it up. Yeah, because it all strength, explodes at the end. Yeah, right? that, like actually Hobbes is way better than Shaw. Yeah. And uh, he succumbed to Shaw to make him feel better. And then that compromise ruined everything. Yeah. And now they're all dead. Yeah, the earth blew up. <laughs> yeah, everything melted down. Yeah. Black Superman won. Every time they do a superhero like that, or like a supervillain like that, where, you know, he's got this virus that's going to half out, like, take out a bunch of the population and, yeah. like, make it, like, so that we have to kind of start over as a society. Yeah. I'm always kind of like, well, let him win sometime. You were rooting for Thanos. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> there were some interesting aspects of Dude, that. He makes a good point. Dan Cummins has a whole bit about how he's like would wants to run for president, but it's on a pro murder platform. <laughs> yeah. Where he's like, I could fix a lot of things, but I got to get rid of like seventy percent of you. So the purge is <laughs> right. You know, yeah. we've made murder legal for twelve right. hours. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. So when like in uh, what was the the Kingsman? Yeah, where they're getting rid of everybody. Yeah, and it's only be like a select few group of people. They're all gonna be the smartest, most intelligent, most like beautiful people, and they stop them. Like, yeah. No, let let them do it, and let's see how it plays out. Let's have smart, beautiful Where's that people. Movie? Where's right? that movie? Where the bad guy it. wins, or where that's the plan? That's the movie that they make, where they're like, "We're gonna kill all the ugly no, mouth that's breathers." A, yeah, and then this is what society would be like. Or is that? Yeah, like, we never get to see what society would be like. Is it too encouraging? Is my question. <laughs> yeah, it's too suggestive. No, because there, there's always gonna be things that like we need done, like. Fast, what? Like I mean, like fast food workers. Like uh, if you're not in a, not in a society of beautiful people, we'll all cook our own food. Yeah. Or you I'm just putting have... myself in this category. Or you have. <laughs> <laughs> Good for you. So, I said we will all cook yeah. our own. Ooh, food. narcissists don't make the cut. You are out. <laughs> how you're on the survival side all of a sudden? <laughs> no, no, oh, how. we'll figure it out, guys. <laughs> Listen, I've been crying for two weeks straight, but I'm one of the good ones. Yeah. Okay. We'll we'll just have hot fast food workers. In. <laughs> They're in there. They're out there even now. Yeah. We've notice how. Polite or like being nice is not in the in that category. You can still be rude and be a bitch, and make the cut. Hey, yeah, survival of the hottest. Right. What do you want? But you got to be smart too. You can't just be hot. It's gonna be hot. But and you can smart. be hot, smart, and mean. Nobody's. Gonna, and, there's nobody and, being and there's mean to. There's two qualifiers for this evil plan: hot and smart. That's yeah. it. Hot and smart. Well, that's rude. Life's rude. We're what do you killing want? a lot of people in this situation. It's an evil plan. You only think that's it's rude, Pound rude Cake, plan. because you it's don't. Evil. You don't consider yourself. Can you we, only consider yourself we, hot, not smart. Can we? Can we put it like it doesn't have to be 30, 30, 30, like thirty three percent hot, smart. I think it should be a little nice or at least funny, right? There should be a personality trait in I was there. Say, but I then, a, but then that's a slippery slope. Yeah. Where do you stop? If you go for nice and funny, where is it? Listen, yeah, then, then beauty becomes subjective and. Intelligence, well, like, oh, he's a genius, like, he's book smart, but he's not street Can smart. Can we go by penis size? No. Oh. Which which category does that fall under? Hot? Yeah, you'd be hot. There's yeah. a lot of really nas- a- nasty looking dudes with... Giant dogs? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. See how you come back on Monday and you have to get back used to talking again? I have to take all the swear words out of my vocabulary yeah, every Monday, and I'm like, I feel like I'm tripping over myself. Sure. Se- seven... And seven. You got to be at least a seven on the hot scale and a seven on the penis scale. <laughs> so there we go. That's how we'll solve it. Wow. All right. Seven, seven, 170. <laughs> That's good. That's a good plan. Seven, seven, seven. Good. All right, now. Well, 170 IQ is there. Yeah. You can be really oh, smart. I thought the weight was 170. Wait, well, it could be 5'2", 170. If only we had a historical perspective on people who tried to create a perfect race. Hmm, I'll tell you what, I'm no Willy Wonka? student of history. Precisely, Willy Wonka. That's right. He only wanted the smartest, best kid. Right. He didn't want the... fat blue kids in there. He didn't want tiny kids. But this isn't like based on your it. race. This is based on your humanity. Your intelligence. Yeah, yeah. This is not, it's not singling out people based on the color of their skin. Right, I'm just like saying that. it's trying to create a perfect society just based no, on different criteria. Better. Just better. Hot and intelligent. Not not perfect, just better. Trying to approach perfection. Yeah. Yeah, yeah approachable perfection. There you go. <laughs> hey, I like that. Approachable perfection. Uh-huh. We're all just trying to get better at whatever we're doing. Sure. 
So intelligent and hot. Intelligent's got to be the top. Oh, yeah. Then There'd hot. be, like, no comics. There'd That's be some why I'm comics. saying we need, some. we need, some, we need a like, personality category in there. You'd have Gary Goleman. You'd have Colin Whitney Cummings. Kane, you'd have Whitney, Whitney Cummings. Cummings. Yeah. It'd be mostly female yeah. comedians. Yeah. Yeah. Theo Vaughn, I'm maybe. Cool that. We could, that. Yeah, we could He's name gotta get like a haircut, 10. Though. <laughs> he can't, he can't, can't be have part a of, mullet. Yeah, he can't be part of the new society with that. You can't bring a mullet into that world. Well, you've got to have, but intelligence takes many forms. You've got to have different that's, kinds yeah, of that's people. That's a slippery right. slope. Well, I'm just saying, either somebody's smarter or not. Mm-hmm. Huh. Hmm. Got a lot to think about. We certainly do. Who would be our president? We've then? got a lot to think about. We, uh, we're I'm including all society. of us in this future. Okay, so we have egalitarian. Have Everyone's, yeah, yeah. There you go. What's it called? Egalitarian. Egalitarian. Everyone's equal in this society. Oh, man. If you can make that happen. I want to be like a fearless leader. I can just like follow and admire. That's why you're not so making you the want, cut. So you want, I mean, uh, you know, the human brain wants to be led to some degree, but that's not going to, yeah, it's not going to make you intelligent or smart. That's fine. Although it would, uh, you can't have an egalitarian society when you've already decided that smart <laughs> and intelligent people are going to be the only ones who are around because it... Runs completely counter to that notion. Well, I mean, so we'll a, set that aside. It's post egalitarian. Right, 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 right. Yeah. Once we've culled the herd, yeah, right. then everyone's equal. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Once the herd has been culled, you, you guys keep putting yourself into it. And I, Alan, you'll probably make the cut. I won't make the cut. No, I think right. you never will. Well, just based on age. Yeah, thank you. Oh, you need <laughs> town elders? Yeah. <laughs> guys, hello. She's I pretty hot. I remember the days. Ah, I remember when the prairie dogs didn't have the plague. You don't even know what ugly people are. Hey, 